Welcome to the church show. Howdy, howdy, howdy. We're back with Moses, and this week we're going to talk about the Ten Commandments. The Ten Commandments. Now, if you've ever seen Indiana Jones, you know he already found the Ark of the Covenant. Yes. And which is where the Ten Commandments were stored, right? Yeah. So, so. But well, we don't know what happened to it now. Well, right? I, I might have a little insight on that. <coughs> we, we don't. Oh, yeah. We don't we know. We don't know what happened sure. to it. We don't know. The FBI is not looking for us or anything. I, I... Way to blow our cover, Merritt. Exodus chapter 19. This is where the Israelites have made their way across the Sinai Desert to the mountain. They in a hot desert walking to a big rock in the middle of the desert. So they've made their way to the foot of this mountain. God calls Moses up on the mountain and they talk for a little bit. And God sends Moses back down and says, look, you got to set up a perimeter around the mountain because I'm going to dwell here for a little while. And while I'm here, the mountain will become enthralled with my glory my and glory. my holiness. My glory. So my if people step foot on the mountain, they're going to die. They're going to disintegrate. It ain't going to be good. Ten commandments. God gives Moses the Ten Commandments in chapter 20. So we were in chapter 19, now we're in chapter 20. So I, I can't help but wonder what it must have been like, you know? Yeah. Well, like, mean, it's all surreal. I, 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 just, I just feel like the ground maybe started to shake or, you know, something. What, what, what's that rumbling? What rumbling? You, you don't feel the rumbling? Merit. <laughs> what? Come on. I didn't do anything. Why the ground So, FBI's not looking for us. Or Might have been something like that, actually. Um. So, so yeah, uh, we, you know, uh, we uh, beat, actually beat up Indiana Jones. I don't know where the Ten Commandments are, but uh, or where they came from. Call, call Harrison Ford. But uh, would you like to read the Ten Commandments, Merritt? I shall. These are pretty important. You're gonna need, you're gonna need to know these. So, man, you did some work on these, didn't you? All right. The Com very old. Commandment number one. Thou should have no other God before me. Commandment number two. Thou shalt not make unto thee any graven image. Don't be worshiping things that aren't God. Yes. Thou shalt not bow down thyself to them nor serve them. So you are only you serving. Go. There you go. The Lord God. Commandment number three. Thou shalt not take the name of the Lord thy God in vain. That's pretty self-explanatory. So instead of saying things like, oh my God, you got to say, oh, oh my God. goodness. Oh, oh my, my God. goodness. Gracious. Goodness gracious me. <laughs> that was really good. Thank you. <laughs> Commandment number four. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. And he rested the seventh day, wherefore the Lord blessed the Sabbath day and hallowed it. Hallowed. Hallowed. I said hallowed. It's hallowed. It's all right. We don't read good. Honor thy father and thy mother that thy days may be long upon. Let me stop you right here. Okay, look. It's one of the 10 commandments that you're supposed to listen to your mama and daddy. Just saying. Mama and papa are Like their the friends. 10 commandments from God's mouth engraved in stone, okay? Listen to your parents. Word, fool. Thou shalt not kill. Yeah, killing is bad. We don't like to do that. No. Thou shalt not commit adultery. That means when you get older and you get married, you're only supposed to be kissing your husband or wife, nobody else. Thou shalt not steal. So don't take from your friends, your family, or anybody, anybody else. Anybody else. Don't take stuff that ain't yours. Yep. Good grief. Thou shalt not bear false witness against thy neighbor. What does that mean, Caleb? Huh? What does that mean? Don't be lying. Okay, just making sure you knew. 
Thou shalt not covet. You know what that means? No. That means since I have the original Ten Commandments, you shouldn't be looking at me and being jealous. No. I'm not jealous. I think it's pretty cool. We'll be back next week talking about more Moses stuff. See ya!